Jet lag. If you guys did not watch yesterday's stream, we watched first episode of Jet lag. Very simple. They're playing hide and seek in Switzerland. The hider has two and a half hours to hide anywhere in Switzerland. The seekers, using coins, can try to find out where the hider is. The hider gets those coins and can use them to, in turn, slow down the seekers. The first person hiding was Adam, who I think had, uh, hid for four and a half hours. And the next hider is our favorite, Ben. And what I've instantly noticed, it got me crazy here, is that this video is shorter than the first one. Because that was 40 minutes, this is 35. So I'm assuming Ben hid so long, they had to break it up into two episodes. For sure. Our four day game of hide and seek across Switzerland. In this game, the seekers must determine the hider's location by buying information from them. In exchange for truthful answers, the hider receives coins that they can use to buy curses that will slow the seekers down. At the end of four days, the player with the longest single hiding run wins. Last episode, Adam was found in a castle in the mountain town of Hospital after hiding for just over four and a half hours. Now it's up to Ben to see if he can beat that time. I He's love got Ben. Two and a half hours to get to a hiding spot before Team his ben. clock starts and the seekers start coming after him. There you go. All right, two hours and thirty minutes starts now. Oh, goodbye. Oh, part of it, by the way, they don't tell you where the person's hiding, which I think I think makes it kind of fun. Makes me kind of frustrated, but it's kind of fun. Ooh. It looks cold. That's just Hello. his white boy swagger. And welcome to my hiding zone, um, which will remain a mystery um, until... They figure it out, or you figure it out. You'll probably figure it out before then. You're, you guys are okay. smart. I did not have as much time getting out of Hospital. I was starting from a pretty remote spot. There also wasn't a train for a while, so I, I really only had about like an, an hour forty-five of actual train time, uh, and that cut down my options a lot. Also, I had to get down from that freaking castle. Is the hider allowed to continue to move? Or no, they aren't, right? We are so back. We're back. I really did not want to have to climb up this thing again, but we did do it. Oh, it's, it's time, it's time. Okay, so so Ben could have gone yes. east, west, north, go over or it? south. That's nice the main enough. directions, yeah. So like seemingly there's like one line west. Yeah. There's one line south, but then it gets complicated at the end. Yeah. There's a line east that does some complication at the end of that. Or what I think would be the smartest move would be to go north yeah. back towards Lucerne because then you have a lot more There's certainly the most optionality is by him having gone north or yeah. south. We all keep talking about Ben's limited options, so just to clarify, because Ben had to start his two and a half hour hiding period from Adam's very out of the way hiding place, he was uh -huh. pretty restricted in how far he could get. Sure. Adam and I don't necessarily know the limits precisely, but we can be pretty confident he's somewhere within this rough blob. That's bad news for Ben, and things are about to get even worse because we have a pretty sinister idea for our first question. We were discussing during our break, and we had an idea. There is an oddball question, which is, send us five words. One of them has to rhyme with your town. If you ask that at the beginning, then they have to cover all their bases. So yeah. Ben will have to send us stuff from, like, the north, the east, the south, the west. Because he's going to send stuff that rhymes with plausible towns, most likely. Yeah, but then once we narrow it down, there will probably be only, like, one, two, yeah. maybe three towns. Oh my god, they're booming my boy. That's so smart, though. Because he's going to cover his bases on how far away the towns are, but when they find out that he's in the north, there's only going to be one or two. Oh my god. They rhyme with whatever yeah. it is. So I think it makes sense to start with that. Let's hit it it is that. diabolical. Let's talk about the it feels like they came up with a strategy the before the right, show even started. Okay. We have got our first... Yeah, purchase. I am a bum. Yeah, I am an hiding out in one. It, it blue bear. Like they're probably pretty confident. <laughs> All right, you got this. Here's the thing. Ben is a lyrical artist. So he's going to create Ooh. words that Ooh, not only God, rhyme with the town name, that also probably inspire. Ugh. Oh, we got an answer. Rug. Right. Rug. So that rhymes with Zug, which we know. Tug. Yeah, that's interesting. 
Awaken, Boxcar, Again, and Clan. It's interesting that, like, Zug or Zug or whatever that town is called, um, yeah. that is a prime candidate. I do okay. agree. Yeah, I felt kind of inspired. It's a highly um, attractive. It's it's almost just like too obvious. Yeah, that's the only makes thing. me think it's the red herring because it's like it's pretty mm. much exactly as far as he could get that way. Right. Lactation boy, thank Although, you. Although Sam, I think we need to ask a relative question ASAP if we want to be able to ask another one before we get to that decision. Two questions yeah, like, already. What one would we want to ask. I think that we should do political party. Yeah. I mean, it's pretty useful. Job. Did your location vote? For the same political party as ours. What is what is that? Geography, I agree. Yeah, we can explain why in a minute, but I think we need to ask it now. Okay, do you what want do you to mean go for as that? ours? Yeah, I think so. Okay, can you text it or should I? I'm texting right now. All right. Just real quick, this question asked Ben if his canton, cantons are like regions of Switzerland, voted for the same party as our canton in the last election. Given the voting map and the blob geography we're dealing with, this should roughly cut Ben's options in half. A yes would mean he's somewhere in here, and a no would mean he's somewhere in here. That's crazy. <laughs> That's crazy. The crazy part is that you can vote for more than two parties. How is that possible? <laughs> How did they figure that out? I thought we were locked to... I didn't, I didn't think they had space for the third. Okay, they have asked another question. Um, they have asked if my canton voted for the same political party as their canton. That is gonna, I think, sort of slice down the possible map in two. Smart question. It's fine. You're allowed to ask a question back to back. You just can't ask a question from the same category within 30 minutes. Ooh, his candidate voted for a different party. So that that pushes toward. So that excludes so that's all of east the west. west. This is east or south. Then. What if I he's think. in that sliver? Wait, so it couldn't be. Let north? me confirm. Would Zug be a different party? Zug is Zug is different. Is Zug Ooh. different? Yeah, it's green. That's huge. That's Whoa. lucky. Okay. Here, we have, once we get to the station, let's do some more research. I hope he's not yeah. at Zug, but they go to Zug. Okay, so we have like 13 minutes. Okay. So we need to decide basically what we Just do. Just ask another question. Yeah. Let's look into it. I mean, for what it's worth, on the line going east, I don't see stuff that like cleanly rhymes. It doesn't. Okay. What's Boxcar trying to do? We should look at like the weird ones. Like, what's he trying to do with Boxcar? He's what's trying to rhyme with also? something. Because here's what I'm saying. Something has to end in Cham. Rug Awake and Boxcar again. Cham rhyme with Clam. Mm -hmm. Which makes me think even more he might be in zoo. Look, Merzingen. No stocks today, mm -hmm. Emily. Cl Cham, clam, zug, rug. Is the, if they're the box they car. They do crush subtitle game. Bar, box car. Mm -hmm. He's got to be up there. The, I mean, it would be a real big brain move to give us four things that weirdly rhyme with stuff in that area. I mean, I guess you could do it to really try to throw us off and maybe it'll work. I just realized I still have this apple. Hell yeah. Take a bite. I gotta get rid of this. Okay. Never mind. I love throwing fruit, man. Well, I think it certainly makes sense to prevailing theory head towards there, right? Yeah. Oh, wait. Should we can we get outside? Oh. oh, will it not stop if we're not I outside? I said what no. I said. Oh, shit. Thank you, Sabrina. Switzerland's such a foreign entity. Is it not going to stop at all? Uh, we'll see. They have train and multiple voting parties. For real? Okay. Um, Adam and Sam still seem to be in Hospital, which means, to the best of my knowledge, they cannot get on a train uh, until 441 in, in like half an hour. More That's than a dub. Half an hour. That's a dub. Um, There's no way to farm points, right? They won't right? even leave Hospital until like an hour into my run, which I mean, is a good start. Okay, so to explain what happened. What we just learned is that to make the train stop here, you have to press the little button. 
And if you don't press the button, the train does not stop. That is so cringe. <laughs> I, I, maybe I guess it's good. You know what I hate in America? And they don't, and, and other countries have figured this out, namely Japan. I hate that you have to fucking still push a button across the goddamn street. I don't like that. I wish you would just always have the allow me to crosswalk sign. Some places the button is fake. In Japan, they have a button and then it says don't press. And then it just automatically turns to a walk signal. Because enough people are walking around that they're like, yeah, we don't need to fucking have a button. But here, man, if you don't press the button, it does not go green for you. Makes me cringe. I just have to jaywalk like an honest American. So now we have to wait, what, a half hour for the next train? Yes. Awesome. Anyway, it's okay. Yeah. It's ultimately We're not a... Oh, just press the button, Ludwig. Like, you've never been in a scenario where you are crossing the street, and then you, the moment you walk up to it, it has just gone green. What do I... I got to sprint to the button to make sure that I hit it so it gets the signal on time? Never have you once been in a scenario. It's a 30-second timer where it goes from the man who's walking to the blinking hand, and the blinking hand's a 10-second countdown, sometimes 15. Many scenarios, I walk up and they're already, they're already, they would have been in the blinking phase and I could have crossed because it's a green light for all the cars, but it's not green for me as a human. A huge deal. It's just annoying. Yes, and, and our fault. And for sure our fault. That's how the jets lag. And that is how the jets lag. Okay, it's fine. It's fine. I think he's got to be there. It's a little bit of a risk, though. It is a bit of a with us. It, it certainly is a bit of a risk. Well, Damn. let's see. Could we Damn, ask Adam, other swear. stuff? Like, aren't all of these fucking towns on the water? Damn, Adam. Um, pretty much, Crass. I think. Couldn't we ask for a picture of a lake? I guess that's... Wait, photo questions are relatively cheap, right? They're like, what? 15. 20, 15? Yeah. I guess, yeah, it could be useful. And we can ask it now. Yeah? Yeah, yeah. Cool. Well... Adam and Sam have requested a photo of my biggest body of water, which is a pretty obvious one. It's this lake here. We're going to use our best photography skills to be vague like about this. Kind of a good one. Let's see here. I've taken a photo of the lake. I do. That's think a pretty good picture. That I've done a pretty good. That's job a pretty good picture. Of including no defined features. That would features. tilt me. It, it is probably pretty clear that it's a lake, although maybe it's not even that clear. It's kind of hard to tell. The photo just looks like water. Oh, we got a we got a photo. Well, that looks like a lake. Uh, it looks like a lake to me. Because because it has to be hundred plus feet. So like that's definitely not a river. No, that's not. A so it seems to confirm north. I mean, everything is pointing. Is there north. no lake south? He's in, he's, he's in the Zug area for sure. I mean, I think we've narrowed it down to, frankly, a pretty tight area. If we're right. If we're right. I think we're right. Probably. Here's one thing I gotta do. I gotta get a place to sleep here. Um, because here's a little hint that I'm I'm gonna give you guys. There okay. is only one hotel in this town. Wow. Okay, I found the hotel. It's my kind Switzerland of like knowledge unbearably is cute. Not helping. Look how Christmassy it is. Okay, well, Adam and Sam are still in. Ah, of course, he's in Gotthard Strassen Sussel. Hospital. Mm. How does it feel, Adam, in the end, having spent the entire game day except for <laughs> one hour in this tiny town? Look. I love. I forgot what it's called. Jetlag. Oh, Ben. That's a nice train. I mean, here's I the thing. that train ben heavy. Was put in a very unfortunate position by having to start here. That's true, and that is part of the strat, you know. I mean, look, it was not not part of why I went here. But. Also, I will remind you that last time we were overconfident about Ben having potentially. It's made true. The last easy. time we were overconfident. Um, uh, he, uh, spoiler alert. He absolutely he, he got won. Us. He won the game. 
We did get absolutely got by Okay, them. got spoiled yes. all last season. They're never gonna find me. It's true. He kind of looks like a minion. Fun fact, this is the bridge where Ben and I knocked apples. That's definitely like a 1500s way to say fuck. I'm not confident I wasn't alive then. I could talk to some people who were, but knocked apples. Definitely a way that people in the 1500s say fuck. I'm only saying that because I read a Twitter thread today about this painting somebody made about the Garden of Eden, the joys of earth and hell. Broshked. And there was a bunch of apples to imply having sex back then. It was all the rage. All right. Well, this is as far as we can get. Yeah, there, there's nothing more we can do. If I said slime and I knocked apples all night and he made me quiver and come, what would you think? <laughs> no, what would you think? Genuinely, what would you think? If I said that sentence to you, you'd probably be like, oh. There is nothing more we can do. It's 5.05. <laughs> The game day ends at 5.30, but we can't get any further. And I don't think we want to buy any more information. No, I think we want to wait until we're closer to ask any more questions. We don't want to give him the potential to curse us, yeah. you know, in a way that could be really disruptive. But I think that's probably it for today. I think that's it. You're do, do a funny stant. You got to you gotta do a funny... Um, do a funny... Uh, oh, do it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Awesome yeah. Do, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah, hell awesome yeah. Awesome okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Is that awesome? Uh huh. Yeah. All right. Now wave goodnight. If you say goodnight. 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 Okay. Well, it seems that uh, Sam and Adam have ended the day in Goshenen, and I have ended CJ, the day CJ, please take the membership. In my hotel room, I've I've set up my strategy, and now we just have to see if it works. We'll just see what happens. Now it's time for the first rest period. Okay. Each day at 5.30 p.m., the game pauses so the players can eat and sleep 30. and not be in the freezing cold for a bit. We'll restart the next day at 7.30 a.m. exactly where we left off. That's a good amount of rests. 14-hour rests. On a four-day, 96-hour, three-night, 42 hours off, 56 hours on. Good morning. We are so freaking... Do they have daylight savings in Switzerland? They do on March 31st. I don't know, someone said they do. Y'all y'all are quick to say nar. But someone said they do. back we're back baby they do look at you rats you it's all the americans shit in chat who instantly go no it's just an american thing it's just an american thing and here we go here we go data triumphs 331 march 31st to october 27th yeah. our train towards zug doesn't leave i was gonna say they have to because if the if it ends at 5 30 it's five ish o'clock right now look how dark it is outside no human wants to live like that year round it's getting dark too early, all right? The sun shouldn't set that late, especially in a place like Switzerland where they are in the earth. It's too dark. It's too damn dark. For what, like 20, 25 minutes 25, or so? 25, 30 minutes? Not the best. Not the best. Anyway, let's do some strategy. This is 7.30 a.m.? Oh, uh, well, sorry, sorry. The, the dark screen's over here. But it was, it was still dark. But you're right. Good morning. We are so freaking. Thank back. you, Mercury, for the 27 back, months. Baby. Our Love train you to your badge. Me too. Doesn't leave for what? Like 20, 25 minutes. 25, or so. 30 minutes. Not the best. Not the best. Anyway, let's do some strategy. So we think we're going to the right place. Look, here's the thing. Either Ben did an absolutely nuts big brain move. Which he has in the past. And he All right, easy idea. This is for Ben, Adam, and Sam. Free Nebula show. It's called Jet Lag. 
BTS. And all it is is vlog footage from the downtime of you guys smoking blunts, freaking your shit, and eating food. You all right? You get, you get, we got, they got a bunch of snack. They do that. Oh. I want royalties. He's done it in the past. Or we know basically the region where he is. And probably have it narrowed down to two towns. What I would say is, assuming that we do know where he is, he, he both was unlucky that he was in a place with unique names that don't rhyme with a lot. And I would also argue that he made a tactical error by giving specific words that only specifically rhymed with like weird places that were right there. Yes, I mean, the, the, the one variable is what if he did that specifically to send us to that place that kind of seems pretty obvious as a place for him to go based on the timing where he left from. But we don't think so. We don't think so. Foreshadowing. That's foreshadowing. The artist, by doing a slow mo and deepening the voice, is attempting to okay. foreshadow. This is a very interesting first one. They've asked for five words, one of which has to rhyme with the name of my town. Here's the thing I kind of want to send them up towards Zug. So I'm going to try that. Oh, we got an answer. All right. Rug? Rug. So that rhymes with Zug, which we know. Yeah, that's interesting. I do agree Zug is a highly um, attractive. That would be a pretty big, uh, big brain he's game. Kinda, he's oh, kind of... the lake. But what about the oh, lake? What about right the now? lake? What about the lake? What about the lake? What Adam and Sam have requested a photo of my biggest body of water. I'm trying to send them to towns that are on a different lake than the lake that I'm on. So I just need to make this lake feel fairly nondescript. Oh, we got a, we got a photo. Well, that looks Damn, like Ben a is owning them. And it looks like a lake These nerds are getting me. cooked. It seems to confirm north. I mean, everything is pointing north. He's in, he's, he's in the Zug area for sure. That's a good point. I admit, that's a good point. See. All right, let's get on the train. He's already halfway through Adam's time and they're going to the wrong area. And he hasn't used a single curse yet. Oh my God. Good morning. I'm back morning. here in my hotel room and we just got to keep hiding. And hopefully they go to the wrong lake this morning. That's, if they go to the wrong lake, then then I'll be happy with my, my strategy. If they go to the wrong lake, then I will have done at least one smart thing on this run. That's, that's all you need. That's kind of my standard. Um, one smart thing, get drunk once. For this game, as long as I can do a at least one smart thing every run, I'll be happy. So let's see if I can keep that up. He's not in an igloo. It's like Sam, look, it's wall. getting less snowy. We are out of the slush zone. Dude, Switzerland's got no the business zone. being that pretty. So the zone. What the I think fuck? we got to start poking around this morning to see if we can find our our final hiding spot. Um, okay. So yeah, let's just let's just go on a little adventure and uh, and find ourselves a spot. Look at all those mountains. I do see the mountains. Yes, it's a great point. All right, so do we definitely want to do tr photo of train station? Why are they talking like aliens? Do we want to look at the options? Yeah, how about, how about let's take a quick look. Okay, so now that Adam and I are headed to the area we believe Ben is, we're hoping to find a cheap way to confirm his location. After some discussion, we decided to ask for a photo of his local town hall, figuring that once we get to Zug, we'll be able to see if it matches the town hall there. So should we go ahead and do that? Yeah, let's request a picture of the town hall. I don't like the town hall. I'm getting further up into the hills. I've made it pretty far out up here. And honestly, I think if I hid this far up, it's just going to be too obvious that I'm I'm up on top of this hill. I think I need to be more in the shit in the in the yep. town. Yup. Cuz there's just going to be more like actual hiding spots. So I don't think that I want to go this high. The uh, the seekers have requested a photo of my town hall, but as far as I can tell, looking at the maps, 
and and doing some googling i actually don't think that there is a town hall here that's bad for you oh um so does does this town have a town hall i don't think this town does but the one um nearby great yes the nearest one would be in thank you so much does that count is he allowed to go there uh, okay. He said that there is not a town hall within his radius. Within his zone. Which either means he has a rather unintuitive zone. Which is possible. But he, we know that the water is in his zone. Maybe he said it specifically to exclude the town hall. It's possible. Just a quick note about zones. Thank you, Andrew. I'll take a go look. more than half a mile from the spot they were when their official time started. The area they have to stay in is called the hiding zone. The rules say there has to be a train station in the hiding zone, but otherwise, depending on where the hider centered it, the zone's limits might make certain photo requests impossible to fulfill. Okay. I'm a little so worried that with that last question, knowing that there's not a town hall in my in my zone, it might make it pretty obvious which town I'm in, um, because I'm definitely in the smallest town that is among the remaining towns. Give me jet lag, Vatican City. If the town is not within its radius, it's probably a bigger place. Just like, or or he could be in a really small place that doesn't really seem to have a town. I guess, but I'd be very small. I kind of think that maybe he's in like a lower zone. They're really on that zug train. If he got off here, he could have transferred and gotten to like. Will be okay. I see it. I see the vision. Would probably not have the Zug Town Hall. Oh, yeah. Like they need to get out of the Zug verse. Yeah. But he could also be like at Zug Friedbach Zug. Look at these. They, they just got Zug on the like mind. Stops him. It is a Zug, <laughs> Zug cost fallacy. It it's an obsession. Yeah, this is all Zug. Uh, this borderline's freakish. Check out Zug. Uh, uh, maybe check out another one, but maybe ask him along. Does he get the money if you he know, can't honestly, finish the task? Just, like, this playground here is not a crazy hiding space. This is pretty far up and pretty far out of the way, too. I know, but I'm gonna... I'm gonna keep looking. I would hide in okay. the water. Now they've requested a train he station. He keeps the pick. money! Um... Wow. I think if I'm clever about the way that I take this picture, like there are certain parameters um, for okay. how we take the picture, but I think if I'm clever about it, Ben's picture must include a five by five section of the train station with at least three distinct well, non wall elements. Train station is hardly a station, but I'll do my best. Oh, this is interesting. The back of the train station looks very different. In the front of the train station. That's good. That could be useful, because then if they go past this, they might they might take one Thanks, look Renee. at this train station to be like, oh, it's not made out of this orange wood. Okay, let's try that. That counts. Yeah. I think that could be pretty sneaky. Okay, so we just got this picture. We are going to pass through on several stations south and south. I, where's the distinct elements? But we just won't stop at them. But we can hopefully, we look really closely. We, we notice that roof red and those color, little hooks. That reddish orange. Okay, I'll pass them along. Okay, which side? Here, I'll look at this side. You look that side. Okay. <laughs> Damn, already three and a half hours. Didn't seem like it. They're nowhere close, bro. You, you guys are in a, you're in the zug I mean, verse. it was kind of just hard to tell. Yeah, although it didn't feel like any of those. Didn't, it didn't really what feel like would it. Have that, which makes me think that. Maybe we should go west first. At least if we don't have other info. Uh, yeah. Well, here, let's, we're, we're at Zug Station now, so let's check here out just quickly and then go from there. Do the zone guess. 
25 mile zone guess? Rule it out. Well, I just took a look at the tracker, and I am afraid that's the wrong way, Sam and Adam. Boom their country asses. Have fun in Zug, but that is not where I am. Ouch. All right, well, let's, let's investigate here quickly first. Dude, the uh, pictures this is not look so different. Yes. After walking around the station, it became clear Zug didn't match the photo. So not even Adam a little bit. looking at more rural stations just west of Zug. There were two... Con Hello? I'm live. Hello? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, attic. Yeah, basements. Old Halloween decorations. Yeah. She said she's not upset, but it felt like she said it in a way where she's upset. She asked me to describe her farts in one word. I said attic. Followed up with basement. I feel like there's three types of farts. There's non-smellers. There's sulfur egg-like farts. And then there's like basement farts. They just kind of smell like uh, like Halloween decorations. You know what I mean? And I don't think she, like because I think I have I, I, my I feel like my farts smell like how you describe a fart smells to an alien. Just like fucking horrendous <laughs> and hers don't smell like that i feel like i i'm realizing now how basically saying she got a dusty acid in the uh, you know what now i get i get why she could be upset i get why she could be upset I answered. Hey, sorry. Arrest me, officer. I'll never ignore my girl. I guess it's a problem for some, not for me. Not for me. Come on. Movies be there. Hey, this is my movie. This is my film. You know? I'll pause it. I'll pause even though I'm enthralled right now. I'm engaged, draw dropped and what have you and whatnot, and as well as other things and so on and so forth and then whatever. Contenders that wouldn't include the town hall, Zug Cholamruli and Cham Alpenblick, so we quickly hopped on a train to give them a look. Buddy, here's a tip. Get out of the fucking Zug verse. Oh, that looks good, actually. Look down, and then I'll come right back on if it doesn't That looks good. No. Next one? No. It doesn't have any sort of siding on it. All right, so getting off here, right? Yeah. He yeah. thinks he's in Choler Mooley, bro. One step further is Cham, which would have a town hall as far as I can And it's the theoretical limit and for this spot. further than that. Yeah. It's a different style of siding, but it's got it's got three vibes. Okay, so it's definitely not that way. Well, it seems like it's for sure not this side. Can you check the next train? There's a train now. Get on that, can we? Yes, we might. Get on the damn train. Well, we're not going to be able to fully check it out, but... Question. Hey, Tevin. Okay. So I've been looking around town trying to find a good hiding spot. I'm really feeling like this walking trail might be my best bet. I'm liking this is this is my leading theory. I I'm really liking this spot here. It looks cute. 
I like Ooh, it. Okay, status report. I am okay. so hungry. But the Dude, only food that this town has is fondue. And I think if I eat any more fondue, something really bad oh. is going to happen to me. Although, the hungrier I get, the more that I hope that they catch me. Because then I can go eat something. You go, they definitely have more than fondue. He's crazy. So, you know, chomp chomp, guys. Come on. I think I think we just need to decide on another question. We could ask for a picture of something. For example, a church. But there's going to be so many. Right. We could ask for a picture. It feels like we probably... Where at least five buildings are visible to get a vibe. <laughs> but that's kind of just a vibe. Maybe an odd... I mean, maybe we just... Yeah. With like a... We ask him for like do the radar, the man, on the streets thing, and just like see Could be if that gets us anything. Because like if he's in one of these like really weird little places, yeah, I don't hate that. How much does that cost? Only ten. Yeah, it could be. Not be bad. It yeah. is expensive. Let's, let's do that. I think that might work. I, I just feel like I would radar off-rip always. Given that I think he must be in a small area, I think we could match whatever the pattern is to places that don't have a lot of points. Right, yeah, hopefully. Okay, I'm into it. Uh, okay, uh, they have requested for me to trace the streets, making at least six turns. I'm not really going to run, because, again, I'm full of cheese, but... I'll get it done for I don't like them. how he's talking about his body being filled with cheese. Well, at least that was efficient. Yeah. Hopefully it was conclusive. But, I mean, it felt conclusive. It felt relatively conclusive. So... That gift store's so cute. I think let's head south now. I guess we might as well we wait for the answer. Yeah, I mean, yeah, while we wait for him to do that Strava thing, I think we might as well head south. I mean, look, it's also technically possible we're not in the right area at all. True. This does seem like a pretty smart question to ask. Is it? that this town has pretty distinctly shaped streets, if they're looking at this town, they should be able to figure out that these are the streets. Which is a little spooky. Oh, he just sent us this Java thing. Okay, that's interesting. This does not seem is to it? match any of the Zugs as I as far as I can tell. Wait, does it match this southern Zug? No. Okay, so I'm really starting to kind of question our assumptions here. Because I think there's a lot more places he can be than we thought. <laughs> Like, I think that we got too focused on the Zug area. Been telling you. And Been now I'm starting you. to think that maybe, like, he could be somewhere quite different. For example, if he got off at Arth Goldau, he could have gone, like, east, for example, to, like, Steinen, which does have a lake. Does it rhyme with something? Yeah, I mean, he could definitely have made it to Steinen. Right? In and, like, time. that would be an interesting and unexpected move. What does that rhyme with? Let me see if that matches Steinen. This looks, this is giving me Steinen vibes. Awaken? It, like, it has like Kirby the right, friends. the whole town has the right like curviness. See like this main road, like, I don't know. It feels Steinen-y. Yeah, I mean, it, it, I think it's gonna be impossible to 100% match, but I agree that like the style of roads looks like that. Well, wouldn't Steinen have a town hall? Actually, look. Look how far that is outside of this city. That's more, that's definitely more than a half mile. Oh uh, wow! I'm already getting real close to uh, to beating Adam's time here. Yeah, you and, are. Uh, you know, I still you got that curse I don't think dice. That barely beating Adam's time is going to give me a winning run for the whole no. game, but no. it'll put me in the lead. I feel like they least. have enough information based off the rhymes, see. the really, town it's hall. Really, going to be a question of. The how lake long it takes to them get to there. figure out that they need to get out of Zug. Because Zug and those surrounding towns, that's not where they want to be. She's Z Steinen on there my are, Zug, like, too. There are, like, travels that outside that station. Uh -huh. I mean, this is probably a lot of confirmation bias, but it seems like it needs to be normal. Yeah. yeah.
So it she seems like on my zug till I, I have figured out that I'm not in the zug area. Um, and they are heading back towards me. So I think it's time for us to go get in position. Because, I mean, if they're heading straight for me, they're going to be here within the hour. Little dice. Ugh. Little cursed dice situation. Gallus takes the membership. Bad. Yes, the, sh the shadow is uh, yeah. not a lake. Yeah, so we discovered that um, in Steinen, w this, we really thought this was a lake, but it actually... Well, big we there. Well, I thought it was a lake, and it turns out it was a shadow. You Adam, you dumb it, son you of a bitch. A lake no, I didn't. Did you not? No. I just trusted you. What about... Okay. Steinen has a lake down here, but it's I don't think far. it would be within his zone. Well, unless, but it might be. Unless he had purposefully gone south, which I don't know why he would have to set his radius. Maybe Perhaps to include less to of the town the, or something, but it seems like a stretch. <sighs> this for sure has the vibes of a place that would have a train station that looks like that. There's the lake. Okay. Sam looks morose, know. like dog. If he that's walked sad. even just a little bit, he could be within the area of the lake. I'm just saying. I have just been informed that that walking path is very much uh, private property, so I've got to very quickly that's beast. <laughs> find another hiding spot. Oh god, this is not. This is not. Oh, free this soul of the crane, man. This is not. Oh. The music's ramping up as if the if episode not, is going to end soon. Not it, I couldn't tell you where to go next. Oh. Are you going to be in Steinen, Ben? Adam, even I don't know because I haven't watched the next episode yet because I don't have a subscription to Nebula because I'm a you loser. Loser? Wait, in I was the plot say that. of this ad, you don't have a subscription to Nebula? No. That's crazy. You My life loser. sucks. But Ben, Damn. it's only thirty dollars for an annual subscription. Whoa, Averages out to about two fifty a, a month. Deal. Let me give you some more reasons to subscribe to Nebula. I'll listen. One. You get every episode of Jetlag one week early. We already sort of covered that. Two, okay. you get access to our Nebula exclusive podcast, The Layover, where we recap every episode of Jetlag. Okay. Three, you get access to Crime Spree, which is the pilot season of Jetlag that's only on Nebula. Four, you get access to all kinds of other great original content. So they don't have a show called The Outtakes, do they? Or maybe they did? Where is it, man? Where is it? From lots of other creators that you probably already watch. But Adam, do you have real engineering on there? Yeah! Do you have real life lore on there? We've got him also! What about Lindsay no, Ellis? Lindsay podcast. Ellis is on the a pod I'm talking about a vlog, a vlog, video log. Platform, Ben, you won't believe it. Well, I'm sold. Look, Nebula is a creator-owned and creator-run streaming platform that's got stuff from all the people that you watch. <sighs> and most importantly, it's only $30 for an annual subscription. That's $30 for the whole year. That's not $30 a month. That's $30 for the whole year. That's $250 a month if you use our code nebula.tv slash jetlag. And I don't want to harp on it, but you really you gotta use our code. There's one you episode don't, for the outside. And they don't know that you signed up because of jet lag, and then they don't know that that, that the whole the only way this thing works is if you use our code. That makes sense. That's what's keeping this whole house of cards up. But Adam, what if I don't know how to spell jet lag? <laughs> J E T L A G. Whoa. Yeah. I'm going to go type that into nebula.tv right now. Nebula.tv wow. slash jetlag. 